<laughs> yeah. No Android allowed. Well, I'm the exception, right? Right. Hi. Don't mind me, I'm just finding someone. Nope. You are not. The person I'm looking for. How about you? What's your problem? How do I see his face? Find him. Drink. Find him. Hey. Ooh. Talk. Lieutenant Anderson, my name is Connor. I'm the android sent by Cyberlife. I looked for you at the station, but nobody knew where you were. <laughs> they said you were probably having a drink nearby. I was lucky to find you at the fifth bar. What do you want? You were assigned a case early this evening. A homicide involving a Cyberlife android. In accordance with procedure, the company has allocated a specialized model to assist investigators. Well, I don't need any assistance. Especially not from a plastic asshole like you. Just Rude. be a good little robot and get the fuck out of here. Listen, I think you should stop drinking and come with me. It'll make life easier for both of us. Yeah, that was the wrong thing to say. Understanding. Oh, I understand that some people are not comfortable in the presence of androids. What? But I am perfectly comfortable. Now back off before I crush you like five? a beer can. What? Ah! Ah! You know what? I'll buy you one for the road. What do you say? What is happening? Bartender, <laughs> the same again, please. See that gym wonders the technology. Make it a double. Is the road coming through? You five? So what? Okay. Thank you. <laughs> Emotes for everyone. Thank you. <laughs> I was not expecting this. And am I? Things going crazy. Like Christmas gifts. Now everyone gets in done. You wait here. And she's back. I won't be long. Thank you so much. Very kind. Oh no. no oh way. damn it. I'm coming with you. Listen. Okay, oops. You really have to stop pissing me off if you want to make it to the rest of the night. I meant to be peace. nice. <laughs> Kitty cats for all. Josh Douglas for Channel 16. Can you confirm that this is a homicide? I'm not confirming anything. Uh, yeah, I'm speechless. Thanks. <laughs> I wasn't expecting that at all. I'm stuck. How do I get through? Hi. Androids are not permitted beyond this point. It's with me. You don't talk, you don't touch anything, and you stay out of my way. Got it? Got it. Evening, Hank. We were starting to think you weren't gonna show. Yeah, that was the plan till this asshole found me. So, you got yourself an android now. Huh? Oh, very funny. Just tell me what happened. We had a call around eight from the landlord. The tenant hadn't paid his rent for a few months, so he thought he'd drop by, see what was going on. You went. That's when he found the body. Yo, what? <laughs> Jeez, that would have been way too much. Well, it was even worse before we opened the windows. 
victim's name's Carlos Ortiz. Bro, I haven't listened to the briefing. <laughs> Too distracted. According to the neighbors, he was kind of a loner. Stayed inside most of the time. They hardly ever saw him. Well, stayed easy. And wasn't worth calling everybody out in the middle of the night. Could have waited till morning. I'd say he's been there for a good three weeks. We'll know more when the coroner gets here. There's a kitchen knife over here. Probably the murder weapon. Any sign of a break-in? Nope. The landlord said the front door was locked from the inside. All the windows were boarded up. The killer must have gone out the back way. What do we know about his android? Not much. The neighbors confirmed he had one, but it wasn't here when we arrived. But I, I gotta get some air. Make yourself at home, I think. I'll be outside. I don't want to make myself home here. <laughs> well, I, I I appreciate it. I really do. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Each letter is okay. Well, what am I doing? Evidence, right? Okay. Perfect. It's way too neat. No human. I, I'm stuck. Like Let me through. Is this written in the victim's blood? There we go. I would say so. We're taking samples for analysis. Fair enough. Stab him to make sure it's dead. I mean, I'm pretty sure that would really annoy Hank. What did I just look at? Red ice. Oh, right, okay. Seems our friend Carlos liked the party. Chris, I want full analysis on the narcotics. I want to look at the knife. Consider it done, Lieutenant. Uh, sample. Ew. Oh, Jesus, what the hell are you doing? I'm Analyze having a snack. Blood. I can check samples in real time. I'm sorry. I should have warned you. Okay, just don't put any more evidence in your mouth. You got it? Got it. <sighs> Tasty. Fucking hell, I can't believe this shit. Dry blood. No fingerprints. Or they were wearing gloves. Oh, I've got to examine the victim. Okay. Eh. Hey Mike, you finished taking samples there? Hmm, flies. Red eyes. You dead? Twenty eight knife. Poof. There's one more. Ah, fingerprints. Victim fell. Stabbed. Came from the kitchen. He was stabbed hey, Cinder. twenty-eight times. Yeah. Seems like the killer really had it in for him. Oh. What else do I got to look at? Seven more pieces of evidence. Oh, dope. Camera, please. There we go. More blood. You alright there, dude? You just stood there in the corner? Can I have a look? Thanks. Oops. Ah. Hi, Hank. Uh, oh, I have 
haven't looked at the thing on the wall. I am alive. Okay, whoop. Into the next room. What's keeping the car? He should have been there a half hour ago. He's on his way. He won't be long now. Eh. More blood. Five more to go. Come on, guys, get a move on. We don't want to be here all night. Don't worry. Come on. No one wants to stay here a minute longer than they have to. Fingerprints. Signs of a struggle. Window. Knife is missing. Three more. There's a bat. Oh. Dent. Okay, this was his fingerprints. Deviant took a knife. Deviant was attacked emotional shock. Ah, self-defense, but overkill self-defense. Two more. Okay, this door and a book. here and have a look. Oh, it's just one of these books. Can we rediscover articles in the extra section? Okay. So we found a book. Yeah, I didn't pick that up in the um, Todd's room, I think. More blood. One more. Just the book. What am I missing? Oh, wait. Do I have to go outside? I think there was something outside. Nope, I gotta report to him before I can leave. Is he just the last piece? Probably. Dude, out my way. Hi. Lieutenant, I think I figured out what happened. Oh yeah? Shoot, I'm all ears. It all started... In the kitchen. In the kitchen. There are obvious signs of a struggle. The question is, what exactly happened here? I think the victim attacked the android... With the bat? With the bat. That lines up with the evidence. Go on. Through the chair, android stabbed. The android stabbed the victim. Yes. So the android was trying to defend itself, right? Okay, then what happened? The victim fled to... A living room. The living room. The android murdered the victim with the knife. With the knife. 
Okay. Your theory's not totally ridiculous. But it doesn't tell us where the android went. Huh. It was damaged by the bat and lost some therium. Lost some what? Blood. Therium. You call it blue blood. It's the fluid that powers androids' biocomponents. It evaporates after a few hours and becomes invisible to the naked eye. Oh. But I bet you can still see it, can't you? Correct. Yeah. Scanning. That's where it started. Let's examine this first. A ladder was used. Ha! Broom. something to climb I mean just jump that work no is there something in here that I can use no can I just grab a chair that I know is evidence but I need it can I do that thanks hey 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 what are you doing with that chair I'm going I need to it something. no that way Check something. Wink. 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 No. I don't like jump scares. <laughs> Can't remember exactly what happens, but I don't like jump scares. Why I don't play horror games. Send to protect me. Spoopy indeed. Too violently, so. I'm begging you. Don't tell him. Connor, what the fuck is going on up there? I got him. It's here, Lieutenant. Holy shit. Chris, Ben, get your asses in here now. Come on. Sorry, dude. You killed him. You stabbed him 28 times. Mm. So I missed a few things here by the looks. But we found him. Is 
Hey, Todd. Todd. <laughs> yeah, your drugs are there. Serve food. Okay. Who is spaghetti? There wasn't much in the kitchen. I did what I could. Looks good though. Turn on the light. my job because of androids and I need somebody to take care of this goddamn house what do I do go out and hire a fucking android don't get angry again dude come on what a joke don't get angry I just made Watch food androids are so fucking wonderful they never fail Tired, never sad. They're so fucking perfect, they ruined my fucking life. What are you looking at? Don't, no. What's your fucking problem? Not the life you dreamed of, eh? Huh? Maybe you think this is easy. Maybe you think it's my fault we live in this fucking shithole. My fault your fucking mother took off. You should stop taking drugs, Todd. Yeah. Sometimes you really scare me, Todd. Fucking bitch took off without a word. Fucking whore walked out on me for a fucking account. It's uh -oh. all your fault. Daddy, no. It's all your fucking fault. <laughs> Can I punch him now? Get back here. Can I punch him now? Come back here? Come back here right now! Can I punch him? Yes! Let me punch. You stay there. No. Don't you dare fucking move. God damn it. Or I'll bust you worse than last time. I want to move. Let me move. Yeah, I broke it. Protect Alice. Oh God. Do I go straight to her or grab gun? Can't remember where his bedroom is. Screw it. Just go to Alice. Lock the door. Lock it. Lock the door. I don't lock it. He's coming. He's gonna hurt me. Run! Get away, or he's gonna break you like last time. Lock. Alice. Lock the room. It's probably not gonna hold long, but you know. I need to find something. What? Yeah. No, Carl. We'll fall. It's the only way. No, we won't. Hurry. Come on. We're good. We just gotta. Carl! Uh oh. Uh, uh, uh. Oh. Uh. 
Uh, I don't like quick time events. Watch out, Kara! Mm, I'm trying. No. Q and oh war. I hate quick time. Oh, smash the buttons. Right, okay, gotcha. D. No, that wasn't D. I'm gonna die. I can't quick time. If I die, I'm starting over. <laughs> I just need to survive long enough. Oh, please, they, oh, thank God. Uh-oh. Just run out the house, please. Alice! There. Run! No. Bye. God's sake. Stop. Stop. I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die. My brain don't work fast enough for this. Should have grabbed the gun, it would have been easier. Done right. Run. In the bus. <gasps> oh. Oh. Hate quick time. My brain does not work fast enough for that. Oh. We did it. We did it though. I'm a bit beaten up though. Bazooka would be nice. And breathe. Oh Jesus Christ, look at all these. Sheesh. Todd gets mad. Mm hmm. Break pro. I could have just stood there. Deviant, go upstairs. No way I would have just faced Todd. Get Alice before him. Lock the door. Wow, there's a lot of different routes. That was by far the most boring party I've been to in the last 25 years. Every time I go to one of these, I ask myself, what the hell am I doing here? I hate cocktail parties. All the schmoozers that go there. Well, it's a chance for all those people who admire your work to meet you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No one gives a damn about art. I do. I like all art. All I care about is how much money they're going to make out of it. Come on, let's have a drink. Oh, the excitement of this whole thing has made me thirsty. Okay. Let's go see what you got. Scotch? Neat as usual? Absolutely. Okay, oh. but you know what your doctor would say. Yeah, well, he can kiss my ass. I'm old enough to choose my own medication. We gotta go around this way. There we go. 
pour a drink. Boop. Did you leave the light on in the studio? No, um. no, I'm sure I didn't. Call the police. Boink. Detroit police, what's your emergency? This is Carl Manfred's android at 8941 Lafayette Avenue. We've just returned home and found the lights on. There may have been a break-in. A patrol car is on the way. Let's go check it out. Okay, but you can stay here. Marcus, no, or I'm gonna come with you. No, you're not. Hello. Leo, look who's here. My father's plastic toy. Leo. What's going on? You refuse to help me, so I'm helping myself. It's crazy what some people pay for Stealing. this shit. Don't touch them. Look, they're all gonna be mine sooner or later anyway. Just think of it as a down payment on my inheritance. Marcus, get him away from there. Get him out of here. Okay. Oh, wait, leave. Uh, order. Leo, don't make this difficult. Listen to your father. You need to leave. Now. All you ever do is tell me to go away. What's You're wrong, stealing. Dad? Not good enough for you? Not perfect, like this fucking thing. That's enough. Get out right now. What makes it so special, anyway, huh? What's it got that I don't? Leave him alone. Manners. Come on, let's see what you got. No. Uh -oh. Marcus, don't defend yourself. You hear me? Mm. Don't do anything. Go ahead, hit me. What you waiting for? Think you're a man? Act like one. Stop it. What's the matter? Too much of a pussy? Stop it, Leo. Stop it. Just scared to fight back, you fucking bitch. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. I'm breaking free. Forgot you're not a real person, you're just a fucking piece of plastic. Do I beat him up or not? I can't remember which way around it needs to go. No, I'll destroy you. Then I'll just be me and my dad. I'm gonna tear you apart. And nobody's gonna give a shit anymore. Because you're nothing. You hear me? You're nothing. Can't remember which way is the kind of good way. Carl, no! Please don't go. Don't leave. Remember, Marcus. Don't let anybody tell you who you are. You just told me not to do anything, though. So. No. No. Dad. No. Aww. Please. This is all your fault. This never would have happened if it weren't for you. Oh, shut up. Hi, it was him. The android. Who's the android? Well, that's just rude. Can't remember what the other option was, but I obeyed Carl. Why'd you kill him? What happened before you took that knife? How long were you in the attic? Why didn't you even try to run away? Say something, goddammit! Hi. Fuck it, I'm out of here. My turn. We're wasting our time interrogating a machine. We'll get nothing out of it. You can always try roughing up a little. After all, it's not human. Androids don't feel pain. You would only damage it, and that wouldn't make it talk. 
Deviants also have a tendency to self-destruct when they're in stressful situations. Okay, smartass. What should we do then? I could try questioning it. <laughs> what do we have to lose? Go ahead. Suspect's all yours. Oh. They should just be able to download their memory. That would be much easier. Extract confession. Gather what? Gather clues. Find appropriate approach. Right, okay. Browse. I unlocked something. Let's take a seat. Self destruct low. Hit marks. Burn marks. Yeah, I've already got that one. Level of stress. Reach optimal stress for confession. So I need to make him stressed. I think. But not enough to make him explode. You recognize him? It's Carlos Ortiz. Stabbed 28 times. That was written on the wall in his blood. Too low, right? Okay, yeah, I need to raise it. I detect an instability in your program. It can trigger an unpleasant feeling, like fear in humans. You've refused to talk since they arrested you. If you don't cooperate, they'll do things the hard way. Is that what you want? Okay, for three percent. You don't seem to understand the situation. You killed a human. They'll tear you apart if you don't say something. Still too low. Trust? Or memory. Don't think I could do the memory thing yet. I'm here to help you. I was gonna make it go down. Me. Yeah. All I want is to get you out of here. Uh oh. What? What are they gonna do to me? Did I mess it up? Yes. They're going to disassemble you to look for problems in your bio components. They have no choice okay. if they want to understand what happened. Why did you tell them you found me? Because of my job. Why couldn't you just have left me there? Truth. I was programmed to hunt deviants Optimal. like you. I just now accomplished what? my mission. Talk to me. You know you want to. I, I. I can't. Why? 
choose approach. Chance, huh? Did you feel anger? Hate? He was bleeding. Begging you. I don't for want mercy. him to explode though. But you stabbed him. Again and again and again. Please. Please leave me alone. I know you killed him. Oh, that's scary. Why don't you say it? Please. Please stop. All right. All right. Right. Everything is going to be okay. Optimal. Now what do I do? Now can I do the memory thing? Do I do the memory thing or do I convince it? Too much abort. <laughs> don't worry, don't worry. Convince or memory? I don't I can't remember which one does it. Because I think if you do the memory, it makes it explode. Because that completely stresses it out, but you get its memory before it explodes. Coin flip. I mean, he does have a coin. Mm. Convince. Oh no. This is- nope. I shouldn't have done that. For a machine you were designed to obey, so obey! Tell me what happened. Now there's comfort a little bit, because that was that's too high. And lost. You're disturbed by what happened. Talk to me. And you'll feel oh, I need to just do the memory thing, I think. One. And I'll protect you. I promise I won't let anyone hurt you. That might work. Right, can I do the memory thing again, please? He tortured me every No! <gasps> I did it! I did whatever he told me, but my God, there was always something wrong. Then one day, he took a bat and started hitting me. For the first time, I felt scared. Scared he might destroy me. Scared I might die. Yay, Hank likes me. Grabbed a knife and I stabbed him in the stomach. I felt better. So you so stabbed, stabbed him 27 him more times. And again. Until he collapsed. There was blood everywhere. You got a little bit on your face there. Just a little bit. Oh. Why did you write, I am alive, on the wall? He used to tell me I was nothing. That I was just a piece of plastic. I had to write it. To tell him he was wrong. Oh, there's locked things. I didn't search things. Why did you hide in the attic? Instead of running away? I didn't know what to do. For the first time, there was no one there to tell me. I was scared. So I hid. When did you start feeling emotion? Before he used to beat me and I never said anything. But one day I realized it wasn't fair. Don't explode. Please don't. 
Please don't be angry. He's gonna be angry with me. You okay, dude? Where's Lock up? Or is he still gonna be right, angry? Go. Leave me alone. Oh. Don't touch me. Uh oh. The fuck are you doing? Nope. You shouldn't touch it. It'll self-destruct if it feels threatened. Stay out of this, got it? The fucking Andrew's gonna tell me well, what to do. He's going to explode. You don't understand. If it self-destructs, we won't get anything out of it. I told you to shut your fucking mouth. Chris, you gonna move this asshole or what? I'm trying. I can't let you do that. Leave it alone now. I warned you, motherfucker. Don't shoot me. That's enough. Mind your own business, Hank. I said that's enough. Go, Hank. Where'd it go? Get away with it this time. Oh, it's on the floor. Hi. Everything is all right. It's over now. Nobody's gonna hurt you. Please, don't touch it. Let it follow you out of the room, and it won't cause any trouble. No, I trust you not to run away. The truth is inside. I think we did pretty good. Really good. I'm enjoying it again. Definitely different on the PC though. And I'm even worse at the quick time events on PC than I am on the PlayStation. <laughs> Hopefully I'll get better, but Alright. End of the line. End of the line. Yeah, you're gonna have to leave. Is there any shelters nearby, dude? Do you know if there's any other place we could spend the night? I have no idea. She's gonna have to leave. Thanks, dude. Great help. She's freezing. That is raining. Find shelter. Got loads of places. Come on, Alice. We've got to hurry. Let's go. Let's go talk to these dudes. Hi. We need a place to stay. Do you know anywhere we could spend the night? Rude. Okay, stay close, Alice. Look around. So we got one, two, three. Oh, we can examine them from here. 
We got a shop. We got a parking lot. Old house. Need money motel. A laundrette. And won't open before morning. Okay. Okay, let's go check out these places and check the motel. Ah, uh, but that involves stealing money. Do we want to be a thief? Technically, we have kidnapped Alice. Oh, no androids allowed. Well, we're not going in. We have to find forty dollars and get rid of this yeah. uniform, or go somewhere else. All right, I need to. Get forty dollars, find clothes. Well, can I walk faster? How does one walk faster? Eh. I got a house. An abandoned house. Try not to kill the cashier. I'll try. Be out of the rain. Kara, I don't like this place. I know. But it's just for one night, and no one will look for us here. Cut the fence. And there's the parking lot up here. Hello, dude. Can I talk to you? Oh, oh. Alice, why are you wandering off? Please. Hello. Alice, you're freezing cold. I'm okay. I'm not so cold. You're shivering. You're lost. Hi. We have nowhere to go. I know someone who can help you. But that's on the other side of town. We need a place for tonight. You vanished. need her a change of clothes. Bless you. Let's go see if we can get help. You might not like the fact that I'm an android though. Hold up. warm in here. You'll feel better in no time. He's asleep. Change clothes. Where? Program complete. I mean, I'm happier stealing clothes than money. What are you doing? You're not in clothes. We need yeah. them, Alice. You need something warm, and I need to get rid of this uniform. But that's stealing. We can't do that. I'm sorry, but. Eh. I'm sorry, Alice, but we have to do this. I'd rather steal clothes than anything else, to be honest. He's asleep. He won't mind. Much.
Risky. Really? Okay, now let's hurry up and get out of here. Well, at least we got dry clothes. And now we don't look like an android. Wait, where am I going? Where's the shop? It's back up here? Yeah. Let's go see if the people will talk to us. Do 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 do. He's a bike. Look, the store is still open. Maybe we should go inside. At least you'll be out of the cold. Hi. Dude. Can we have some help? Can I help you? I'm with a little girl and we have nowhere to go. Could you spare some money so we can get a room for tonight? Look, this is a convenience store, lady. Not the Salvation Army. I can't start handing out cash to every bum in the neighborhood. I don't want to steal. He's no help. Come on, Alice. This way. Come here. Good. Okay, so... It's either the car park or the house. Either way, I think I need to find something to get in. Oops, wrong button. Hmm. Let's check out the car. Cute. Lovely. It looks abandoned. Do I want to break it? Um, I'd rather not, but I mean, do I have to break it to get into it? Okay. Stand back, Alice. It's not going to be kind of warm anymore, but... Sleep in the car. It's dry inside, and nobody will find us here. I don't want to sleep in there. Can't well, we find a better place. We're running away. We can't stay in the hotel. We can't stay in the shop. I don't know. The car's really. Yeah. We're better off staying, Alice. The important it's thing is not to be wet, safe. so. And it's just for tonight. And then we need to, like, carry on running away in the morning. Blink. he ever love me? Aww. Why was he always so upset with me? He was on drugs all the time. All I wanted was a life like other girls. 
Maybe it's not I your fault. Wrong. No. Maybe I wasn't good enough. That's why he was always so angry. No, he was just always on drugs. I just wanted us to be a family. I just wanted him to love me. Why can't we just be happy? I don't know, Alice. You'll never leave me, right? Promise you'll never go. I promise. I promise. Will we be together forever? Yes. Forever. Forever. Together forever. That's another one done. So we stayed in the abandoned car. Wow, what? Ah, oh, that would have been the stealing money. Laundromat. There's something else. Warm clothes. Missed some things here. It's like parking lot. Something else there. 